I'm pretty darn excited to be able to bring you five different makeup cases that I have been trying out and figuring out whether or not they are ones that you guys would love as well. And I think that the five that I've narrowed it down to, they have great organization. They have great ways to store your makeup when you're traveling or if you just wanna put it in a makeup bag like I do. Because of my disability, I do sit on my bed and I do my makeup while I'm in bed. So having it all together in one place is what I need very much. And we're going to talk about five different ones most of these you can get on amazon and i didn't check but i think that the fifth one you might even be able to get on amazon so let's get into five gorgeous makeup bags and let's do that right now All right, if you are a makeup lover like I am, you go overboard. And I do all the time. I definitely go overboard. And I like to pack more makeup than I need. But then when I get there, I feel like I have everything that I want. I can do a little bit if I want to a little bit extra. Now, saying that, I have a huge makeup train case. You could put all of your makeup and your skincare in here. I just have makeup in here. This one is a big one. This one does come in a medium and it might even come in a smaller one as well. You can always look around after you click on this one, you can look around and see if there's one that might fit you better. But this one's a big one. This one has two compartments, one at the top and then the other one down here where you can keep your the majority of your makeup. But let me just show you the organization in this one. This is is probably the biggest one that I've seen. I really love this one. This one is probably my favorite out of all of them just because I can put so much into this. I mean, I put a lot in here. Let's open up the top. And in the top, as you can see, I have a lot of different things. Now this could be used to hold any liquid bottles you wanted. I just put in a lot of my compacts because it holds them really steady in there and I really like that. And then as you can see, it also has a great pocket area too. Has a place where you can put more brushes if you want to. I put liners in there and then it has a secure compartment where I put my odds and ends. I put a sharpener, some scissors, some eye tape, a cleaner in here, cleaner rag in here, some um, corrector, concealer, my eye primer, all kinds of that. So that goes in that part and that is a lot of storage there. And then opening up the main part right here, you have a ton more um, storage for brushes or for eyeliners or whatever you want. And it's got the plastic across it, the plastic flap that goes across it so that you can keep those um, cleaner or away from your other makeup, which I think is great too. And then in here, you have the same thing as before. You can rearrange these. It does come with a few more, but I like the way that I did this. It just seemed to help keep everything okay. And you can fit so much in here. As a matter of fact, there's a Natasha Denona eyeshadow palette in here and there's a lot of other eyeshadow palettes in here which I love because you can't do that in other ones and oh by the way up here in the pocket behind the brushes there's a big palette that I have from ColourPop in there as well and it holds all of my primers my sprays a ton of different foundations and i liked that because you know when you do foundations they're a little bit longer and i wasn't able to put those so easily into other ones but being able to customize this is so good the outer part of these you can wash with a soap and rag this one is quilted so you can easily find a way to wash these up if they get dirty on you and then the second one that I have is this one. And this one, you can't get the actual colors of this anymore because my husband bought this for me a couple of years ago, but you can still get this. This is by Triforce. And this is a definite love for me when you go on an airplane or when you know that your makeup is going to get kind of jostled about. It has a hard shell case. And I think that's great about it. And it also has on this side, it has this little um, band where you can hook it onto your other luggage 
as you're um, rolling your other luggage around in the airport or traveling, whatever. It has two sides and then each of those sides opens up and it does have Velcro so you can lay it flat. Now let me show you the organization inside of this one. The pattern isn't available anymore. The Triforce has different patterns. They go through different things. This was bought about three years ago, but it is a hard case, which I really like. And again, it does come with the strap that you can use there. I just have always used it as a tote. And then on the back, you have, again, that strap that will hold onto other luggage so that you can um, not worry about having to carry it separate. So let's open this up and see what we have on the insides. On the inside, you can see that there is a lot of storage in there. Now, this does have Velcro tabs that you can undo really easily and it will lay flat, which I think is really good too. You have all kinds of mesh pockets right here. You have a full zipper pocket that I put a bunch of, um, usually I put my eyeshadow palettes in there. But down here on this side, I put away a lot of different things. If you have sponges, it's a great place to put those because you have the mesh right there as well. So this is very roomy on this side. And these zippers are really, really nice zippers. I mean, this is a very well-made bag. And the way that you can travel with it like that or lay it flat is a big bonus for me. And the zippers on the outside are extreme good, extremely good quality too. I've had this for, like I said, for years and nothing has ever happened with any tearing or any, you know, fraying or anything. So on the other side, when we turn it around, we have the same thing where you can hold it open like this and you can tell that there's a bunch of dividers in there or you can open it with the Velcro on the sides and it will lay down. Now up here I have my foundations that are in that elastic tabs. More mesh pockets over here, which I just use a ton of things in. And then this right here is where there was a mirror and I accidentally broke the mirror. It's not really anything that I would do my makeup with anyway, so it's okay. And then right here you have some tabs or some elastic tabs that you can put your brushes in. And then down on this side, you have one big pocket right here that I put a ton of stuff in as well. And you can go ahead and strap that together with the Velcro if you want to too, so that that's not moving. So this case to me is perfect for travel because it is that hard case. And if you were gonna get bumped around or anything, you just really have a way to protect everything. And again, if you stuff it full, 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 it doesn't matter because these zippers are very high quality and they will, you know, push it all together and it will really be very durable for you. I'm going to stick this one in the middle, but this one I absolutely love. It's not exactly a full makeup case, but I think if you're like me, you're going to fall in love. This is just almost like, looks like an old CD case that we used to carry around with us, but this is a makeup brush case. Look at this thing. Isn't it beautiful? I love this. This has every single eye brush that I own in it, which is saying something, but it's got an upper and a lower part right here where you can put them. So let me get you a close up of that one as well. I love that this has two different kinds of fabrics on here. It has the vinyl here, and then it has kind of a soft vinyl fabric here and then the rivets on it. So cool. I just really thought it was great. But when you get inside of here, it is so wonderful for carrying your brushes. Now this right here is a microfiber cloth that you can put your dirty brushes on this side if you want to, and it helps keep your other brushes clean. Say if you were using cream products on one side and you wanted to keep those cream products off of your other brushes. But this organizer, is something that I am absolutely over the moon happy with. This holds every single solitary eye brush that I have. And I could not believe it when I got it because I was using the little round cups where you had to, oh, where's that brush I need? Where is it? Where did it go? Or in a drawer, 
it just makes it so much easier to be able to use these. They can be separated into brand. You can be separated into kind. Whatever you want to do, they're there. This is, has a very easy cleanup because it can be washed with a rag with a little soap and water. So nice. Now, the other thing you can do, and I will show you how that works, is you can fold this backwards, and then there are tabs here, and there's tabs here, and you clamp those together, and you can do that on both sides. You clamp those together, and then you have it so that it will stand up. And you could put this on your vanity if you're you know, traveling. How easy is that to have it right in front of your makeup? So great. This is one of those finds of the year for me. I was so excited about it, and I love that I can hold all my brushes in here. I might buy another one just for my face brushes because I definitely wanted to have just my eye brushes and be able to see all of those at once. And no, I don't use all of these every day, but it's sure nice to be able to have these where they are so easily accessible and you can have them set upright. And I, I'm absolutely in love with this. I think it's one of the best finds I have found off of Amazon in a very long time. Next is this rose gold one. Again, these are huge because I, I love makeup. I carry around a lot of makeup. I want to have my everyday makeup in just one place, but this one is a little bit thinner. I shouldn't say thinner because it looks huge, but it's a little bit less um, wide or less deep than that big gray one was. It also has on the back of it the, the tab or the strap where you can put it over your luggage and do that. It also does have this right here that you can hang on one of the door hangers if you want to. And then it also has, it comes with another strap that you can put on any of these to hold it more securely. So again, let's get a little bit close up and let's look at this one. And I'll just start with what is here on the top so you can see each section as we go to begin with you have a mesh pocket right here which is really big so if you have anything that you need to keep super dry maybe you do a sponge you want to put it in here so it doesn't get onto your other makeup I have a couple of palettes in here and then I have some eyeliners in there so that's going to keep that very secure and then going up a little bit you have another flapped pocket right here that has some storage where you can secure some things I have a couple setting sprays in there and then over here is a zipper pocket that I put a full-size palette in that has that can go all the way in so you could put quite a big palette in there if you wanted to so then as I unzip the next section again it has a ton of storage now these pieces right here will come in and out and you can fit these however you want they come with more pieces than are than are here but as you can see this holds a lot and then my favorite part is all of this secure holders that you have up here that are individual and you can put brushes in here you can put eyeliners concealers whatever you need you could probably fit tons of skincare skincare in here as well. I chose rose gold um, for this one, but I do think that it comes in a couple of different colors, maybe a pink and a black. And then lastly, I was so excited to find this one. And the reason is, is because for me, this is an upright makeup case. When I say that, you don't have to lay anything down. And so I absolutely adore using this for all of my skincare. My skincare can all stand up and my hair care. I have hairspray in here too. This has several pockets. So you have the front one and then you have some side ones as well. The side ones almost come all the way down so they open up all the way. Let's get closer so you can see this one as well. Now most of those other ones I've had for a while but this one I am the most excited about and that's because this is what I use to do hold my skincare and the reason that I love it is because it's taller and you can keep so much of your skincare upright which i think is fantastic so you have the pouch right here that's in the middle which is quite big and all of the skincare that stands upright there's a lot of places that will hold them in place instead of them just flipping around in here so you have a lot of that 
hair care and skin care for me this is wonderful and then right here on the top there's a mesh bag which i keep my makeup remover cloths in there and also i love that it has a swivel hanger on there so you can hang it up over a door when you're traveling so that is there and then on both of these sides you have openings that you can put more into and it does have right here if you can see it does have the elastics that keep so much in place they do seem to be a little bit bigger but for hair care and uh, shampoos and that kind of thing that's great and then on the other side you have the same exact thing I love how wide it opens up so that you can see in there and you know what you have and all there's three of those elastic pieces that keep everything in place there so you really can see that this is a big one that's going to hold so much and then right here this is the pouch that is in the front so you have a zipper pouch which i just keep a few little incidentals in there some cotton rounds and my balms and then also down here i keep all of the things that will hold tightly and not just be jostling around inside here my eyelash serums my eye creams my lumify brightening drops some of the ordinary so this is really handy to have so let me see if i can just pan you out a little bit and you can see how nice and big that whole entire thing is this is one of my very favorites so that's my roundup of five makeup cases that I absolutely love. Do I need five makeup cases? No, but I wanted to review five makeup cases for you guys. Technically it's four, but it really ended up being five with the brush case. And the brush case was such a fabulous find for me. I was so excited about that because I usually am digging through bins or going through glasses and trying to find which one I want. That's just laid out perfectly. Each of these is very affordable. I would say the hard case one from Triforce is probably the most expensive one, but to me that was worth it to have that security of that hard case on the outside. So I hope that you did enjoy seeing all of these today. Let me know in the comment section if you're thinking about getting one of these and if one of these might fit your needs. I would love to hear that from you. Or if you have one that you absolutely love that you couldn't be without, let us all know that in the comment section too so that we can check it out. Thanks so much for being with me today. I hope everyone is happy and healthy and doing well. I love you very much. Let's all meet back here in my next video together and I'll see you very soon. Take care. Love you, friends. Bye-bye.